Hey everyone, this is David. I'm back again making a little video about throttles and batteries. So uh, I have this uh, LunaCycle GA battery. This is the 48 volt Sanyo uh, 10 amp hour battery. You can see that um, the voltage is about, about 47.8 volts. So we're going to hook it up to the throttle to show you what um, this displays. So I am um, using my uh, connector here, connecting it to the battery, and it's giving that it's um, halfway uh, the charge, and um, that's pretty accurate. So this thing is working. Let's find. Let's try it with another battery and see what happens. So in here I have a, a big 48 volt 20 amp hour battery and uh, this is a pretty older one. Let me show you what it looks like inside. Uh, it just looks like this. A big, it's a big battery that I use commuting. This is actually, this is one of my uh, most reliable batteries that I have. So far I've um, charged it about 200 times. So I'm getting my money's worth with this battery and it uh, goes I use it for commuting and it's no problem so I connected it here and you can see that I still have plenty of juice in that battery okay guys I'm back again with another battery this is a 36 volt 15 amp hour battery this was purchased um, with my electric Brompton from Nice Wheels, probably around 2013, 2014. So this is an old battery. It still works. I mean, uh, it still works. I'm actually going to use it tomorrow for a part of my commute to work. And what I like about it is, there's only one thing I like. It has um, a nice quiet charger. I have two chargers. So I have one at work and one at home. And then I use this, I call this my Sunday battery because if you're just going to go around the block or do something very easy, I will, it's kind of light and I can just put it into the bag and ride around with it. So let me show you what it looks like since this is a 36 volt battery and this is a 48 volt display. You can see that it's only showing one, um, it's showing empty. Just showing one. Okay, let's go to the next battery and final battery. Okay, guys, I'm back again. This is my 52 volt battery, 20 amp hour. This is uh, the NCR uh, B cells. I bought this from LunaCycle. Really nice, really nice battery. Unfortunately, if uh, you've seen some of my previous videos, I can't use all 58.8 volts with it. Long story, there's another video out there. So I just charge it 80% to 56.6 volts, and I'm able to get about maybe uh, 20, mi you know, 20 miles with it. And it's nice. It's a really nice battery. And uh, so I plugged it in, and you can see that... Um, since it's a 52 volt, this is a full charge, or because of the volts are too, um, it's above 48 volts. So I uh, hope you like this. This is becoming one of my favorite throttles. I know that throttles is really touchy because some throttles, I'll do another video about this, some throttles are not waterproof, some of them break, some of them are delicate, some of them just suck. But I like this one, nice thumb throttle, has these, to, now I, I know how to um, solder this correctly so that you have all four by using a JST four pin connector. And it has this nice button that you can probably use for a light, or maybe in the winter time, I'll be using this for my electric hand warmers that I'll be putting on to the grips. I do have another video that shows how I make those electric cam warmers possible. So, thanks for watching my video. Once again, I have a 36 volt display here and a 48 dis volt display here. Everything seems to be working nice. Thanks for watching my video.